So earlier today, I streamed Overwatch. I did the Winter Wonderland update uh, that came out for the game today. I played it for around three and a half hours. The good news is, those who were watching the stream of Overwatch liked it. They said that it looked good. It, you know, it looked like pretty much the same quality as everyone else's Overwatch streams on Twitch. So that was good. The bad news is, the YouTube videos, meaning the videos that I recorded for YouTube, don't look very good. And what I mean by that is not the visuals. The visuals look fine. They're not pixelated or anything. But the frame rate, the frame rate is not a smooth 60 frames per second like I would like them to be. Now the reason is because I was streaming here on Twitch at 720p resolution. But I was recording at 1080p resolution, which means my computer had to do double work, and therefore the videos on YouTube ended up suffering because of it, okay? Um, <clears throat> I was a little upset, I'm not gonna lie, I'm a little upset, but I'm actually happy that it was just a, a random stream of Overwatch that this happened to, rather than me starting up, say, a brand new game playthrough, and then I go to look and the, and the game videos would've looked like shit, okay? So, what I'm forced to do, moving forward, okay, is the following. If I'm playing a game, that runs at 30 frames per second, there's no issue at all. Sadly, it looks like I'm going to have to make a decision, alright? And the decision is going to be the following. Do I record and stream at a lower quality? So, for example, if I'm going to play Modern Warfare, and I want to do some multiplayer of it, I'm going to do 60 frames per second, I want that quality, do I record at 720p and stream at 720p so that I could do it on Twitch, okay? Or, do I say, well, unfortunately, there's no way that I could do it at the quality I want, uh, so I'm gonna go back to YouTube for a stream, which I could do. I actually have the capability, if I want to stream something on YouTube, I can stream that. If I want to stream something on Twitch, I can do that. Um, but I do have the capability to go back and forth between the services, if I don't stream the same thing on both, okay? So the big- I was actually talking with the stream chat about this. Uh, <clears throat> yeah, I was talking with the stream chat about this. Um, and it seems like it's kind of a mixed bag. I mean, some people are of the opinion, well, you should be recording at the highest quality, because that's what people want to see on YouTube. Other people are like, yeah, but honestly, if you're going to be playing the hot new releases, and you want to get that kind of attention and maybe some extra money, and you want to do it on Twitch, you got to do it at the lower quality, you know, and get do it on Twitch, because streaming on YouTube, no one really shows up, which is kind of true. Um, so I don't know, I'm going to have to, the first release coming up is Resident Evil 7 in, in uh, you know, January, where this is going to be a dilemma for me. Because <clears throat> I know it runs at 60 frames per second, but I don't know uh, if I'll be able to... You know, I, well, I know I won't be able to record at the higher quality and stream at the lower. It's just not going to work, okay? Oh, excuse me. I'm still sick. Yes, you can hear it. <laughs> still got the nasal drip. Still got shit gunk in my fucking throat. <clears throat> but it is better. Every day, I can tell you this, it is getting progressively better. A little bit better. Every day is just a little bit better. So hopefully another couple days I'll be back to 100%. Huh. <sighs> My goodness, I gotta wake up. I gotta wake up to play this. <laughs> 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 